This is Mohamed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can use limiting criteria for uh, drafting in the Power Design Workbench in Category 5. So to start off I'm going to remove the previous drafting which I've done in my previous tutorial and uh, let me start off fresh. So firstly I'm going to use a draft tool and I'm going to select the phase which I want to use as phases of drafting and let me select a normal neutral element any neutral element which you want and the uh, result is going to be a drafted phase which is going to be uh, inclined like this so what happens once I create two planes right here 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 and here and that's going to act as a limiting element so I'll click on cancel and I'll create such two planes so one is right here and uh, the next one is again uh, right here somewhere over here so now I'm going to use a draft tool and select the face and neural element and click on more go to the limiting element and click on the limiting element so in this case I want the drafting to happen outside of the plane and in between I don't want any drafting to happen so I'll click on OK and you're going to get some error it doesn't matter so this is the uh, this is the result of uh, drafting using the limiting element limiting planes uh, in the uh, drafting tool in part design KTV5. So I hope you enjoyed my video. I hope you uh, completely understood what all you can do the scope of uh, draft tool by these uh, video series. So I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe me, like my videos, uh, ask me doubts, uh, give me suggestions and uh, make the channel lively. Thank you.